Hi guys, this is Farz and welcome back to Farz Lozim. And in this tutorial, we will learn how to create and save a zip. Uh, what is the pronunciation of Z-I-F? Zip or GIF? It can be a topic of debate, right? So I'm giving you the topic of debate. You can comment what is the right pronunciation because I'm also confused. Okay, leave it. The basic thing is, the main thing is, we will learn it today. How to create zip and how to save it as a zip in Photoshop. So let's get started. Okay, uh, let's create a document first. Go to the file option and select your new. And I'm going with 500 pixels to 500 pixels. Okay, uh, so here is the canvas of mine. Okay, now you can, uh, you need the object, you need the equipments to make the zip. Okay, uh, you can paint by layer by layer to create zip also, or you can also use the external object or external subject, whatever you call it, uh, to make this zip. Okay, uh, in this time, I'm using uh, the two skull. Okay, let's see. These two skull, look at this one is closed eye, and one is the eye of love sign. Okay, I'll use these two. Uh, you can use this type of uh, illustrate or these type of things object or or also you can paint you can paint with the brush by layer by layer and then make it as uh, a zip or save it as a zip or some animation create some animation okay uh, okay let's first uh, use this one just click and drag it on the canvas press and hold shift uh, to place it on the center like this and now bring the second one again press and hold shift to place it on the middle okay here i am using the two characters only one is closed eye and one is the eye with the love sign uh, so you can use as many as you want okay um so this is it okay let's make it a little bit smaller click the two layer press ctrl and t and now let's make it a little bit smaller to understand okay and now the basic thing is you can see now hide the layer too look at this look at this you can you can feel the emotions you can feel uh, the uh, movement the animation look at this we are gonna actually making this as a zip now it is just a normal zip file okay uh, now go to the window option and here you will find a option called timeline now just click on the timeline option and look at this here you will find another uh what should i say another window in the bottom okay and if you click on this uh sign and here you will find the two options create video timeline and create frame animation so in this time we want to use the create frame animation because we want to make the animation right so click on this and now click on the create frame animation option it's already done the frame animation uh, option is now appeared and look at this option just click on this option and from here uh, just click make frames from layers because we want to make animation from the layer one and layer two so select the make frame from layers and now you can see the one two three because of the background but we don't need the background okay so click this and delete it Okay, now here you see the layer 1 and the layer 2, right? So one is closed eye and one is the eye with love sign. So this is the basic and now we will work on animation. And now come into the bottom and look at this, look at this triangle, just click on this triangle and there is three or four options. Uh, one is once, uh, one is three times and one is forever and other. Okay, this is the loop count option okay uh, if you say it once it will stop uh, the animation will stop after once if you uh, set three times the animation will stop after three times and if you select forever the animation will never stop and also you can put your own value okay so i'm going with forever and then you can uh, see a play option the play button play animation option and now look closely at the bottom of the layer you can see zero second and zero seconds 
actually this is the duration time of your layer or the delay the frame delay time okay so if you um, said a zero second look at this uh, just click on the play button and see it's too quick right okay so stop it and select the both layer now set it to one second so the frame delay time is now one second and now click the play play button again and now look at this it's too slow it's too slow click the two layer again and select here uh, 0 0.2 second okay and play again look at this i think now it's it's fine it's normal you can also uh, set 0 0.1 second okay i'm going with 0 0.2 second this time okay but the background is empty we want a background right so come into the layer option and let's give a solid color uh maybe dark red okay it looks fine and now again uh, click on the play button and see look at this it creates animation right okay okay you can add some more drama too okay let's do it uh click on the layer too press ctrl and t and then make it a little bit bigger press enter and select the play button again and look at this it creates more drama right so the basic thing is pretty simple now you can use your creative brain and make the animation make the zip more creative more beautiful okay now we'll see how to export it as a zip okay let's stop it and then go to the file option and here is the export and select the save for web legacy and here you will find all the options zip zipfake png so we need zip so select the zip and now click on the save option and just you can uh, rename it and save it's pretty simple it is done so this is all about the zip or gif i hope you love this tutorial if you did hit the like button leave your comments and don't forget to subscribe